Bay County housing officials are answering some questions and concerns that residents have about a new public housing developments. The 308 units will help low income families struggling to find affordable housing since Hurricane Michael. As News 13's Jake Holter tells us, county officials say they'll need to fill a need for the community that the housing and rents have just gone sky high. Hurricane Michael destroyed most of Bay County's affordable housing, leaving many living in substandard conditions. Tuesday, Bay County Commissioners and the Panama City Housing Authority announced 308 new units coming to the area. Why not um, have rental developments of this caliber come in and, and help these families live in very decent and safe setting that is affordable for them? The developments will be located here on 11th Street and here on Florida Avenue. They're meant to assist families who earn up to 80% of the local median income, about $78,000. A family of five earning less than $65,000 would qualify. The goal with HUD and then locally with Florida Housing Finance and then with local government is that low income families and under do not pay more than 30% of their annual income on rent. A three bedroom apartment would not cost more than $1,563 a month or one third of the family's monthly income. The two and three bedroom units will be family friendly, including self-sufficiency programs like job training and after school care. We're getting families uh, leased in here that they can, when it's all said and done, still have enough income at the end of the, the month to, to make a car payment, put food on the table, gas in the car. On-site case managers will determine eligibility through financial documentation. In Bay County, Jake Holter, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Construction will begin in October and will be completed by March of 2024. For a full rent breakdown, you can visit our website, mypanhandle.com.